at the corner of Drexel and Howell, uh, looking at the Delphi Delco Electronics plant uh, that's currently under the stage of stages of demolition. Uh, it's June 30th, 2010. Uh, this plant has been in operation or had been in operation through the 19 from the 1960s through just last year now been sold and ready to be replaced by something new here we're looking in through the windows of the uh, front end of the office building uh, you can see that the the inside's been torn out the outside structure still exists I wonder what they did with all of those asbestos laden panels in the front offices Here's the location of the uh, time capsule that was set up in 1996 to be opened in 2056. It's no longer there. It was saved by Bill Moore and uh, uh, someone else. They've taken it to the place where it was originally built and we're still looking for somebody that might be interested in helping find a, a permanent home for it. Uh, so we saved it from the destruction. Looking in through the windows from uh, Drexel, you can see part of the structure still exists back there. It's probably the area where the uh, uh, where the clean rooms were originally in the old days. Uh, don't know. Obviously, nothing's there now except except structure. Here's the uh, old geodetic reference that was used to find the stars back in the days when we needed to do that. Uh, for the uh, early navigation systems. It's been sitting idle for many years and it looks like even in the demolition they haven't figured out what what to do with it. So if anybody's interested, uh, I'm sure you could uh, uh, take it away for the cost of moving it. Here's the back end of the building where I'm sure many people re remember going into work every day. And here is uh, what's left at this point. In Time. Uh, not a lot. And finally, a final shot of a parking lot no longer in use. For a few more memories, here's a shot of the old administration building built in the 60s, uh, now replaced by a Sonic Drive-In and a Woodman's Grocery.